In our news from Haryana, where the Chief Minister Bhupinder Singh Hooda faces an administrative crisis today with two lakh government employees planning to go on strike. Well, the officials say that they will begin this three-day strike today after the state failed to meet their demands. In response, the government has imposed a curfew across the state to prevent gatherings. It has also asked each department to make alternative arrangements to keep work going in government offices. The employees want the abolishment of contractual employment and outsourcing of work. They also want the government to fill up pending vacancies and regularize all part-time employees. Finally, they want the cancellation of permits to private bus operators in favor of more government buses. So that big strike uh, planned for today in Haryana where the government uh, could in fact see a disruption of uh, all major services, two lakh employees of the government uh, going on strike. Our correspondent Manuman Singh China will be joining us in just a few seconds to get us more info. In fact, he, he's through right now. Manuman, if I can come across to you, uh, how is the government planning on keeping important services going with so many, uh, ten, well, two lakh uh, uh, employees going on strike? Well, uh, yes, Pierre, what uh, the government has done is to begin with, it has uh, clamped down uh, on these associations. It has imposed Section 144 across the state so that uh, services are not disrupted. However, these uh, employees, they are absolutely determined to ensure that this strike is successful over the next three days. Uh, just a few weeks back also they had gone on strike, but the government had assured them that uh, action would be taken on their demands and they had called off their strike. But this time around, uh, they know that uh, because the, of the impending general elections and later the assembly elections uh, this year, uh, this is the right time for them to force the government to accept their demands and which is why they have gone ahead. And essential services like the transport uh, and uh, hospital services are likely to be affected uh, by this strike today. We're going to wait to see how this pans out, Manaman. Thank you for getting us that early update and look ahead into this story.